Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another video. So I'm here with my brand new Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. Okay, so in this video, we're going to take a look at the AOD mode, the always on display mode. Okay, so we're going to take a look at how it works and we're also going to take a look at the customization options. Okay, so at the moment, the AOD mode is pretty much simple because I've just unboxed it um, earlier today. So I've not had the chance to customize it up. So if I tap on the display once, as you can see, it's pretty much basic. Just the time there with a battery percentage there below it. But I want to customize it more. So I'm going to show you how to do that, guys. Okay, so first of all, you will need to find the always on display mode settings. And the easiest way to do it is to go into the settings there and then scroll down to lock screen. And here you will see always on display. By default, it should be on. And then down here, you will see clock style. If you select it, you will have these two options here, always on display or lock screen. So select always on display. And now you can see we have a bunch of different clocks. So there's six clocks to choose from. And then if you select this option here, it will bring up some more options where you can add the dual time or the calendar widget or any of these other widgets to the lock screen. But for now, I'm just going to focus on the digital clocks and the analog clocks. So there's two types of clocks to choose from, digital and analog. Okay, so below it here, we have some different color options. So the default color is white, but you can also choose light blue, purple, a peachy orangey color, green. So these are all solid colors here at the top. And then below it, we have these rainbow colors. So getting a bit close with the camera, I don't know if you can all see the rainbow color. So there's quite a few different rainbow colors to choose from. Okay, so once you've finished choosing your color, you can just go ahead and hit done. Or if you want, you can just select this option here and you can choose from the gallery and you can add a picture or you can choose and add a theme. Um, my stuff. So you can even add a theme. Or you can add a GIF. So there's loads of different GIFs to choose from. And you get a little preview of how it will look before you actually apply it. Um, I'm just going to add my picture. So once you're finished, just go ahead and hit done. Oh, wait a minute, guys. Yeah, just go ahead and hit done. And here, where is it? If you tap on the always on display option here, you can set how long you want the always on display to show. So you can have it showing for 10 seconds, or you can have it to show always, or you can schedule it as well. And you can also change the screen orientation and the brightness. You can also show music information on there as well, if you like. So let me just show you the always on display now. So here it is. You can see my picture there. And if you double tap it and select the settings, it brings you straight back into your settings. So you can make any adjustments that you want. Well done, guys. So 
So yeah, if you double tap on it, it brings you back into the settings. So you can use it as a shortcut basically to get back into the settings to make any adjustments that you want. So yeah guys, this was just my video taking a look at the always on display mode at, on the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. The regular S21 should have this option as well and also the S21 Plus. Anyway, it's your boy Android Doctor. I'm out. Be sure to like and share this video. Doses.